you don't want it enough. Mm. If you mm. wanted it, you would find a way, mm. right? Mm. If you don't, you find an excuse. I mean, mm. that's been thrown around loads, mm. but it's so true. Mm. And people don't like hearing that because they go, well, you don't know what's going on in my life. And it's not about that. Mm. When you want something, it's not even when you want something, because that sounds selfish, mm. doesn't it? Mm. When I want this, so mm. I'm going to do this. It's more about, like you just said, when you value yourself and your mm. body. Mm. I used to say, I still say to teachers now, I say, you are your best resource. Mm. So you put it in business terms, you're your best asset. Mm. You, yeah. Are. Yeah. you are your best asset. Yeah. So if I come up to this interview today and I'm looking shabby and I'm hungover and I'm late, mm. well then I've not done myself a, a justice ever. Mm. So you've got to take, even just on that level, what are the things I've got to do to take care of myself so I perform at this, this kind of thing. And for me, body's been a central uh, thing since I was, well, when I was younger into martial arts mm. and then as I got older I started doing weight training, yoga, bodybuilding. Uh, and having CrossFit. So I've always pushed myself and explored the body. But basically, your body is, is incredible. But you've got to give it what it needs. Because I, again, I don't play this game of Google. I'm in the 30s, I'm getting older. Rubbish. And my dad started marathon running when he was 37. I know people that like got into 80s and 90s and that kind of thing. So again, it's that thing of, I actually said, I wrote a blog on this. I said, if you want to make a change, do it in December. Give yourself a couple of weeks, get some momentum. So by the time everybody's there with their fizz, you're just like, you know, playing that game. Like I've already got ahead. You know, do you know what I mean? But also think long term, because you see all these Instagram twelve week transformations and stuff, yeah. But what happens after that? You've got to live in your body every day. That's why nutrition's so hard. There's nothing you do every single day, mainly, except for eating, drinking, that kind of thing. So what I say to people is like, oh, man, your body is an amazing, beautiful thing. It's your body as well. Like I got all sorts of things wrong with my body. Like I've got bad eyesight, I've got a straight jaw, mm. I've got flat feet, but mm. it's my body. Mm. And like, it's like you can either go for this thing that doesn't exist and mm. say, when I get that, I'll be happy. Mm. Or it's literally like going, right, I've got this thing. Let's, let's see how far mm. I can take this thing. And that one I think is a lot better because mm. how people do that will be different for them. But yeah, just cheerlead you from a business point of view. Eat something before you go to a meeting. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you perform better. Mm-hmm. But all those kind of things. Regulating yourself around where you need to perform. Mm-hmm. Learn that from the gym. Mm-hmm. Rest and recovery. Because mm-hmm. especially in business world, it takes chunks out of you. Yeah. And if you're not at that kind of like higher level of percentage yeah. of energy levels, again, you do yourself a disservice. You know, if you're sat there tired, you might miss opportunities. Yeah, that's it, that's it. So it's valuing yourself and just saying like, you know, why well, I can't lose weight in January, I'd say, well, why do you want to lose weight? Because mm. I want to feel better about myself. Oh, that's cool. Mm. How long are you going to give yourself? What, six weeks? Mm. Why? Mm. You know, so I, I, like, I'm trying to get stronger at the moment, like really trying to get stronger. Mm. It's hard. Mm. <laughs> it's really hard. Yeah. And I've dedicated a year. And even now in the first, second month, I've started to understand it might be more of a three year thing. Because it takes that while like, I'm talking long, three to five years. Mm. That's okay. Those out years are going to pass anyway, aren't they? Mm. And you're going to look back and go, like, I couldn't do that. So, what I say to people, slow down. Mm. You get to March, like, so what? Mm. 